Fox News Flash Top Entertainment and Celebrity Headlines are here. Check out what's clicking today in entertainment. Loretta Lynn has announced an all-star livestream concert to benefit the victims of last month's deadly Tennessee flooding. The country music legend and Humphreys County resident has enlisted her pals Garth Brooks, Trisha Yearwood, Luke Bryan and Luke Combs to participate in the show, with more to be announced. The flood that devastated our area has been awful, but love is stronger, the 89, year, old tweeted. I'm so grateful for my friends who are answering my call for us to all pitch in and help every way we can. I am so honored that so many of our friends are coming together to show so much love for our neighbors and community after such a devastating loss, said the singer in a video post. You know, we've all needed help from time to time, and that's why when we can give back, we do. Foreman of Loretta Lynn's Tennessee Ranch Killed in Flood the Benefit Concert, titled Loretta Lynn's Friends Hometown Rising, will take place on Monday, September 13 at 8 p.m. ET 7 p.m. CT at the Grand Ole Opry House in Nashville. The broadcast and live stream will directly support United Way of Humphreys County. According to Lynn's website, the event will be broadcast live on Circle Network and live streamed on Circle All Access on Facebook, Twitter and YouTube. Tickets are available at Opry.com on a first, come, first, served basis beginning at $65. United Way of Humphreys County has been dedicated to our communities for years and we established the Humphreys County Flood Relief Fund to get immediate and long. Term needs met for all the flood victims, said Executive Director Nyoka Curtis in a statement. We had no idea this would be one of the worst floods in our history. But our community will be whole again, the message continued. It's UWHC's goal to help make that happen as quickly as possible with the help of our generous donors. From the rental deposits and down payments necessary for people to get re-housed, to remodeling, replacing clothing and rebuilding their lives. We want to make sure their needs are met and we will continue our fight to make that happen. Click here to sign up for the entertainment newsletter Wayne Spears, the foreman of Loretta Lynn's Ranch, died in a recent flood, Loretta Lynn Ranch, on August 17. Record, breaking rain sent floodwaters surging through the rural region, killing at least 22 people, including the Lynn family's own longtime ranch hand Wayne Spears. It also destroyed hundreds of homes. The devastating flooding took out roads, cell phone towers and telephone lines leaving people uncertain about whether family and friends survived the unprecedented deluge. Many of the missing live in the neighborhoods where the water rose the fastest, said Humphreys County Sheriff Chris Davis, who confirmed the 22 fatalities in his county. The names of the missing were on a board in the county's emergency center and listed on the City of Waverly Facebook page, which is being updated as people call in and report themselves safe. Click here to get the Fox News app the Humphreys County Sheriff Office Facebook page filled with people looking for missing friends and family. GoFundMe pages asked for help for funeral expenses for the dead, including seven. Month, old twins swept from their father's arms as they tried to escape. The death of the twins was confirmed by surviving family members. The Associated Press contributed to this report. Thank you.